A quick disclaimer, you should know that this tutorial is for a third-party asset. That means that it has Playmaker integration, but its functionality and stability is not completely reliant on Playmaker. These tools have bugs of their own, and so you should always first consult with the developer of that tool first. Also, there may be links in the description for fixes. Hello, and welcome to the Getting Started with Final IK in Playmaker tutorial. In this tutorial, we're just going to set up a project so Final IK can work with Playmaker. And all that really means is that we're gonna come over here to our assets, down to the plugins folder, and then in plugins, we have root motion, then final IK, and then integration. Now integration has all these packages. You can see we have one for Playmaker here. So if you double click on that, you'll get prompted to import their actions. I already did it, so I'm just gonna hit okay. You should have a little import button, you can click that. And once that's done, you'll see that over here in your action browser, you'll have a new category for final IK. So I'm gonna click on that, and I'm just gonna disable previewing our actions because some of these are pretty big actions. Great, so now we have all these actions that we can use to talk to Final IK's components. Be sure to check out our other videos to learn all the various features of Playmaker. Links to more learning resources are in the description. 